Powered by the all-new 2013 Ford Fusion, the official car of CES. Hey guys, Mike Roman here for Techno Buffalo. I've got two models in my hand that I've been waiting a very long time to get my hands on. These are the Lytro cameras, the world's first light field camera. What that means is you can actually take a picture and you don't have to worry about focusing. You can actually focus after you take the picture. So these cameras have very good depth of field and allow you to manipulate that in post. On first impressions of this camera, it looks like a giant thing of lipstick. It really does. I could also hold it different ways. I could kind of hold it like a lightsaber or I can hold it overhead like a telescope. Check out the back of this thing. We've got a shutter button on top here. There's actually a recessed area on top of this camera and that is a touch sensitive area and that's for zooming. LCD on the back here, although it's very small, it is touch sensitive and it's very easy to use, it's extremely intuitive. There are no real manual controls to speak of on the Lytro camera and that's because Lytro plans on shipping an auto mode version of this camera um, and they're not really delving into the manual controls. They plan on releasing one of those at a later date but at the moment we've just got touch sensitivity. We can swipe up to get this um, small utility tray here and here we can transition to macro and there's also a battery indicator which is super nifty when you're shooting out there and you're a little worried about how much juice you have left in your little lipstick case. And this is a metal housing, this camera, so it should be pretty durable. I really love the grip also, it's very comfortable to hold. We've got a USB terminal hiding out underneath here and a power button. Now, in order to access playback, it's simple. You've got a live view on the LCD, all you have to do is swipe over to the right and you've got your images right here. Now the cool thing about this too is you can actually tap on different areas of the picture while you're in playback mode to um, access different depths of field actually. This camera is going to ship at the end of February and we are hoping to get our hands on one very soon for a full comprehensive review. I'm going to put this thing through its paces, put this lipstick case through gadget boot camp, that's right. The Lytro is going to be an exceedingly successful camera. The question is image quality. Based on some of the sample shots I've already seen, this camera is very promising. So I'm going to have the full review for you very soon. This has been Mike Roman for Techno Buffalo. You guys keep it safe out there. I'll catch you on the flip side. The 2013 Ford Fusion is loaded with new features. An engine with EcoBoost and Auto Start Stop allows for max power on the highway, efficiency in city driving, and even turns itself off when at a stoplight to save fuel. Thanks to Ford for powering our CES coverage.